hi folks so yeah I've swapped battery out uh, I didn't mess about this time you know like usually when I'm out and about and I'm uh, filming and stuff and I try and squeeze as much out of uh, the batteries as I can uh, but today uh, I didn't want to mess about uh, so I just thought I'll just swap the battery out and just get on with it that's a really cool shape I love that whatever that is um, right I just want to have a quick look I just as I was walking past the gate we're going we're going back that way shortly oh, well look at the sky cool cool sky um, yeah so uh, as I was walking past I saw this thing this um, cream colored white creamy colored object and I'm thinking what the heck is this can you see that I mean, what the hell what is it what is this nondescript flipping huge big lump of something <laughs> I'm just really curious. I want to know what it is. Oh, you know me and my curiosity, guys. What am I like? I told you I'm part cat. I am definitely part cat. There's no two ways about it. I think that's what I was in a previous life. I was a cat. <laughs> so like I say, we're back in Kensington Gardens now. Uh, the heck is this? Quite an interesting looking thing. Looks like uh, no, it's not really, I'm going to say it's sandstone, but it's the wrong colour for sandstone. Yeah. Uh, right, there's a thing here that tells us presumably what it is, but huh. okay, let's have a nosy. Let's see. What is this? Thing? Oh, Henry Moore's the arch. Oh, it's a Henry Moore. Oh, okay. Wow. Oh, we've got a lot of wind right now, guys, so I don't want to chat for too long on this, but... Uh, where's the arch? Was it, when was it made, then? Because, I mean... I don't think he's no longer with us. He hasn't been with us for a while, has he? So, I don't know when he died, but... Uh, huh. I mean, the sitting, it says 1962, various uh, created versions of the arch in three different... Oh, okay. Uh, okay. So, wow, that's pretty cool, man. Right, okay. Uh, I'm trying to get out of this wind a bit, guys, because it's, you know, it probably sounds horrendous on here right now. Right, so for the time being, I'll leave it there and I'll catch you... Ooh, whoa. Wait, sorry. Uh, I keep spotting stuff. That's got to be Kensington Palace down there, then, is it? Is that Kensington Palace down there? Wow. Do you know, this is a part of London that I've not frequented that often, necessarily. And uh, when I think about it, it's like... No, I don't know what that is, to be quite honest. It's making me think it's that, but I don't know. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. Uh, Looks like there's a little folly over there and all that. Can you see that? What they call a folly? It's like a little... Uh, sometimes they're made out of wood, sometimes it's stone. But it looks like a little... Kind of little folly thing over there. Uh, but anyway, yeah. Because um, I've not frequented this part... Uh, that much. Um, it... Yeah, and because of the extensiveness of it, um, you know, it feels almost like you're in the countryside. Do you know what I mean? It really does. Oh boy. But that's one of the beauties about London as well, you see. It's got so much green space. Do you know what I mean? And, and you know, the thing is that they'll never lose those green spaces. They're, they're well protected. Particularly, I mean, something like this. This is a royal park. There's no way, do you know what I mean, that it'd ever be uh, developed. Do you know what I mean? Not in a million years, as far as I can tell. Anyway, uh, you know, well, you, you know, like to say, never say never, I suppose. But, uh, but anywho, that's an awesome sky. I love that sky, by the way. Sorry, that is cool. Wow. Uh, but yeah, sorry. Um, I forgot what the heck I was just about to say then. Uh, oh, sorry. Okay, 
um, I'm really curious as to I'm not going to go in there because uh, like I say I really need to try and keep an eye on the time there's one thing I hate is being late for anything but particularly for work uh, right oh, oh it's, a, it's an art gallery Serpentine Art Gallery oh I've never been there before Ooh, we'll have to pay a visit in there one day I think if I can remind myself uh, yeah yeah I think definitely check that out um, right uh, sorry folks I really need to uh, go to the loo uh, and uh, I'm finding it really difficult to concentrate at the moment so uh, okay for the time being uh, I shall leave it there uh, and I shall catch you guys later bye for now uh, hi folks Ooh. Yeah. let's see this is uh, more of that horse um, bridal waist thing uh, as you can see it's rather uh, waterlogged at the moment uh, and these little uh, things here these little uh, I think I guess they're like little boat houses or something you store boats inside it I guess I'm not sure uh, it looks like a little cottage almost <laughs> oh boy anyway so basically you want to keep heading in this direction uh, I'm pretty sure right down there where you can see that blue well I don't know what you can see actually until I look at it on the big screen so I'm assuming that maybe you can see where the little paddle bolts are down there and then that uh, sort of building just beyond it uh, there should be some loos down there uh, and I hope that they're open and available because <laughs> really really need to go it's getting rather painful and yeah I don't know what they store in those things because they're right out on the water you see so I'm assuming they've got like doors on the back of them and the boats just go in and out I don't know I'm not sure what they are uh, that's that's just my conclusion I have no idea because uh, I can't see the back of them of course from here so I don't know if they've got doors on the back that you know, then the boat can go in and out of uh, right okay so uh, yeah so maybe you can see the paddle bolts better now now that we're getting nearer and then I'm assuming that you can then see that building uh, not the brown one but the one that maybe in the camera appears to be white uh, but that building just behind there I think there should be some loos oh boy I flipping hope so Whew. <laughs> sorry I know going on about it sorry it's just it is getting rather painful look at this little thing here little cottagey thing cute that's nice isn't it <laughs> imagine living there huh? imagine living in there uh, oh dear yeah so Kensington Park slash Hyde Park uh, it's massive isn't it I mean we are actually in Hyde Park right now uh, but uh, yeah uh, uh, sorry oh it's really hard to concentrate honestly uh, because it's rather painful at the minute trying to hold on to this uh, Oh God, blimey, Charlie! Um, yes. Yeah, so, um, oh, sorry. What the heck was I just saying? <laughs> what was I waffling on about now? Oh dear. Um, oh, that interesting-looking catamarangi boat thing. <laughs> um, what the heck was I saying? Oh, it's gone completely out of my head. I have absolutely no idea. Uh, Oh well. <sighs> Sorry folks, it's just oh. <sighs> right. 
I think for the time being, until I can find somewhere, uh, I'm going to leave it there for the time being. And I'll catch you guys later. Bye for now. Okay, folks. So, uh, God bless me. So that building, that little building behind me, uh, with the uh, little roof. I don't know if you can see it or not. Uh, but just where that tree is, anyway. Uh, there was a loo there. Oh man. And uh, although normally you pay 20p to use it, it was open. It was just open, so I just walked in. Anyway, oh thank God for that. Oh, so much better. Oh, I tell you, the older you get, and when the cold air and the combination of cold air and coffee and age, oh my God. <laughs> oh, it's amazing, isn't it? It's amazing. Certain. Um, I know this is a bit early in the morning, and sorry if this is too much information, but um, you know me, I'll talk about almost anything and everything. Uh, but as you get older, uh, those normal bodily functions, like going to the loo, uh, uh, particularly when it comes to the number ones, uh, oh my god, I'm telling you, oh, it's amazing just how painful it gets. Do you know what I mean? It's like, seriously, you know? I mean, it gets really painful. And it's like flipping, it, it hurts so much, it's like, oh my god. You know, and I think to myself, why did nature do that? Why did make, I mean, okay, I get it, you've got to go, you know what I mean? When you go, you've got to go. But, you know, why make it so flipping painful, man? Oh, boy. Phew. Anyway, sorry. Yeah, sorry, I know. Uh, <laughs> what a thing to be really waffling on about, huh? Oh dear, sorry. It was just that it just really hurt, it really did, you know, and it's so uncomfortable and it's like just so difficult to concentrate, you know, and even walk at times, do you know what I mean? Because every step is like, you know, it just adds to that flipping, you know, oh god. Anyway, sorry, yes, I know. It's like, why am I waffling on about such a was um okay great i can't think of a word to describe that now uh anyway yes blah 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 so yes okay so now we're at hyde pike <laughs> now we're at hyde park corner uh and you can see possibly when this tree's out the way oh well, then again there's lots of trees in the way right now uh anyway Okay, wait until we get to the corner and I'll try to explain. But the top of that building, uh, 100 Victoria Street, is right in front of me. I can see it peeping through at the back there. Uh, so we're not a million miles from work and it must be turning about nine now. Uh, yeah, let's, let's do that again, eh? Let's see, if, see how accurate I am this time, eh? Uh, so I'm going to say... No, actually, wait. Do you know what? I'm going to say about quarter to nine. Ten to nine. <laughs> Ten to nine. Oh, flipping heck. No, it's... See, again, I'm not far off. Do you know what I mean? It's like, just gone five to. Uh, so, okay. Kind of proving myself wrong now, aren't I? Slightly. Although I'm still close. You know what I mean? Uh, and I think overall, generally speaking, I do tend to have uh, a sort of, you know, good sense of time and the passage of it. Uh, so, yeah. Okay. So, let's get across here. Whoops. Hmm. Yeah. Flipping cyclists. Anyway, uh, so, right, so this is Hyde Park Corner essentially, uh, and, and you can see 100 Victoria Street right there, uh, a big tall building behind the trees over there, uh, so as you can tell we're not a million miles away from work, so I've got an hour, and it's not going to take me nowhere near that to get over there, uh, so, yeah, so we've had a good walk round anyway, uh, 
So we went all the way down that way. Uh, and, you know, I couldn't tell you exactly how far down, but we are a good ways down there. And then we came all the way around there, come right through the park, and then obviously here. So, right. Oh, that, that, that's quite amazing sky. Awesome, man. Right. Okay. So, uh, again, as usual, not sure whether there'll be any other vlogs after this or not. Uh, but uh, stay tuned to find out. <laughs> so, I'll leave it there and I'll catch you guys later. Bye for now. Hi, folks. So, uh, we're here, we're at work, we are not started yet obviously, uh, it's 25 past 9, uh, so I've got myself another latte, uh, which didn't cost me anything, which is cool, got it from the Verdi shop, uh, anyway, uh, so, I was thinking, uh, I remembered as I was um, coming down the road, uh, that, um, I've now actually reached my 300 subscriber. Uh, and like I said, when I, I was planning on, once I reach that uh, milestone, to do something to sort of mark that as a special occasion, as uh, like a bit of a milestone sort of reached for me. So, uh, this weekend, I'm definitely gonna try and plan something uh, different, uh, something that I'm, Maybe something I've done before or something. I'm not sure yet exactly, but I, I want to try and do something different and special to mark the 300th subscriber. Now, the other thing is, is that um, I also realized now that I'm actually over the 300 mark, so I've got like 301 subscribers. So in some ways, I've kind of missed that opportunity a little bit in a way, but maybe not quite. I mean, anyway, but. The thing is, definitely this weekend, possibly Saturday. Uh, yeah, I think Saturday would probably be the best day. Uh, and like I say, we'll go somewhere outside of London, I think. Maybe not too far exactly, but yeah, maybe possibly outside of London. Uh, and like I say, something different and something to... It's okay, I'm filming me. <laughs> it can't see you at all. Uh, so, yeah, so... Uh, sorry, what was it? Uh, yeah, so somewhere definitely outside of London. Um, and yeah, uh, so I don't know. Uh, yeah. Uh, sorry, that's just kind of just put me off my, my what's the name there. Um, they thought I was taking, they thought I was filming in that direction. I'm obviously filming me. So, um, so it's kind of thrown me a little bit because they're still standing there. Uh, anyway, anyway, so, but, yeah, so, I want to mark that, do something special outside of London, uh, and, like I said, at the moment, I'm not sure exactly what that's going to entail or where that's going to be, um, but, yeah, uh, so that's pretty cool. Okay, so, for the time being, uh, I don't think there's going to necessarily be any more, uh, vlogs this morning, um, but, because, uh, like, I'm going to drink my coffee, have another fag, and then obviously it'll be near time to go into work. So, for the time being, I'm going to leave it there, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye for now. Okay, folks, so finished my shift, and I was thinking of going for a little wander. Uh, don't know why particularly, but I was just... Uh, you know what I'm like, once I start vlogging, I can't stop. But, look... It's, it's flipping raining uh, and you should have seen it just before I mean it started really pouring down like you know so uh, yeah I don't think I'll bother to be quite honest because uh, uh, yeah no it's a bit too wet I think so oh well but yeah so I was gonna do like I said I was gonna go and do another vlog uh, but yeah flipping so it's lucky I did it all this morning, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? It's like, uh, oh wow. <sighs> anyway, I am super tired as usual. So, but yeah, I'm all right. I'm quite good actually. I'm in good spirits, good fettle. Uh, I'm feeling really, really, uh, feeling pretty grand as it goes. Uh, yeah. So, 
Okay. Alright. Let's get through the barrier. Oh man. Yeah. So yes, yeah, good day. Uh, and uh, yeah, I, I just feel a bit of loss of words for, uh, at the moment again. I think it's really because I'm really, really tired. And I've noticed that at the end of my shift, towards the end of my shift, so like the last 15 minutes, generally speaking, uh, I seem to make the most mistakes uh, towards the end of my shift. And I think it's because that's when I'm getting tired. You know what I mean? So, uh, and when I say mistakes, they're just little tiny things, nothing major. Do you know what I mean? Just uh, tiny, tiny little things. But um, yeah, but otherwise, yeah, feeling really good. Uh, these, these. Because these announcement things are really loud, aren't they? Oh, the heck. You see, they always say, never give an ordinary a microphone or a speaker because uh, we're loud enough as it is. <laughs> and that's come from a fellow northerner. Oh boy, and I love that. I think that's so funny. It was so funny. Uh, you know, don't get, don't give me a microphone. I? Us northerners, we're loud enough as it is. <laughs> we don't need a microphone. Oh, I love that. That's so funny. Oh boy. Right. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> it's kind of a bit boring, this little bit, isn't it? It's like, what do I waffle on about? Anything particularly interesting? Nothing springs to mind right this minute. Uh, but I always like, I've got into the habit now of doing this now. So I kind of like, I really enjoy and like doing the last little vlog before uh, I actually get home. Uh, and I like doing the little vlog down here. Uh, I find it really interesting. Uh, okay, uh, because I'm basically drying up, and uh, I haven't got a clue what to waffle on about right now. Um, and all it is is a flipping boring tunnel anyway. Uh, so uh, I think for now, uh, I'm going to leave it there. Uh, <laughs> and I'm going to catch you guys later. Bye for now.